You're listening to the Ask Drone You podcast. You ask, we answer your drone questions. Whether you're here to turn your passion into profit or you simply fly for fun, we're a community of learners and teachers who aspire to achieve greatness. We are Drone You. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the 2018 Drone You Fly In is right around the corner. This is the only drone conference that actually allows you to fly real world flight missions. That's right, nine different missions and multiple stations within each mission allow you to truly test your drone skills. What are these missions? They're gonna allow you to practice, to subject track. They're gonna allow you to practice cell tower mapping, crime scene mapping, payload deployment, and so much more. The Drone You Fly In is one of those few events where you can actually learn to not only better your skills, but learn from other people around you. It's a three day long event, two days of a lot of flying, and the last day with a mixture of classes to help you augment your business. In addition, this year we're actually offering a business boot camp as well. So you're ready to kickstart your business and ensure that you're actually building the business of your dreams, then increase your revenue, increase your motivation and inspiration. Check out the Drone You Fly In. It's DroneUFlyIn.com. That's D-R-O-N-E U. F-L-Y-I-N.com. We'll see you there. Welcome to another quick, easy, and simple episode of Ask a Drone You. My name is Paul. My name is Rob, and this is episode 783. As always, thank you for being with us. Hope you're getting a lot of flying in, getting better every single day. Hope your business is growing. And uh, thank you for sending in questions. We really do appreciate it. We do appreciate it. Well, let's get right into today's question, which should be pretty easy Uh, for most people. So let's go ahead and play that question. Hi guys, this is Tom from AreaDroneMaster.com. I'm calling from Paris in South California. So first of all guys, thank you for all you do. We really appreciate it. I do have 107, which is going to expire this year. Uh, In order to keep the 107 valid, we have to take the exam again. But here's my question. I'm thinking to get my PPL, the private pilot license. And I was wondering, if I get my PPL, do I have to retake the 107? Or maybe there's a different exam for PPL people to keep 107 valid? Or maybe there is a way to be waived from that exam if you are PPL. So that's the question I have. And thank you guys again. Thank you very much for the question. It's a good question. I don't know how many people out there are going to get their PPL and and think that might be a a way to not. um, Of course, let me say this. We don't actually know right yet what the what the renewal system is going to ask of uh, 107 pilots. Well, according to um, according to the FAA, uh, I don't think there's going to be a change. I think it's still going to be a test. I think we're going to see a huge decrease in the number of 107 pilots this year, but we'll see. Should be interesting to see what comes of it. Well, I wonder if that's true is simply because they're all saying that they're not being the rules aren't being enforced anyways. I mean, that's going to play into that as well. It's something that Vic and I talked about on episode 780 which I found uh, just really, really interesting. Uh, it's also been brought up by other people. So um, anyway, long story short, if he becomes a Part 61 pilot, there is this great thing called PowerPoint. It's not actually PowerPoint. It's an online web portal for Part 61 pilots to essentially answer a bunch of questions concerning drones. Uh, and they can take the test as many times as they want until they get 100%. I mean, it's literally like the easiest thing ever. Mm-hmm. Um, so At your desk. At your desk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, it's super easy. So to answer his question very simply and easy and to keep this episode extremely short, which I know you are just begging for more content, um, to keep it short, if he gets his Part 61, he can get his Part 107 via the online PowerPoint for Part 61 pilots. So the answer is yes. All right. Well, Voila. easy enough. Easy peasy, pumpkin squeezy. If I you have a like, question. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. I, say, I feel like we should just banter on about something because it's so short, but we won't do that. No, no. I got a lot of work to do. The fly-in coming up, wedding coming up. There's a lot of stuff going on. Drone You Elite is about to offer trainings all over the country. We're expanding to 10 new cities. Like, huh. It's a lot of work. It's good dude. times. It is good, good times. times. You got to be grateful for it. And on that bombshell, don't forget to be grateful yourself for what you have 
right now because you never know what you have until it's gone. That's going to do it for us today. My name is Paul. I'm Rob. This is Ask Drone You. (laughs) 